Contrary to news out yesterday, no concert venues are pulling out of Miley Cyrus's Bangers tour, but according to Forbes.com, the singer might have a bigger problem to deal with right now, and that's lower than expected ticket sales. Yes, it does seem like America, and really the world for that matter, can't get enough of the former Disney Channel star, but that doesn't seem to be translating into fans actually purchasing seats for her tour. In fact, Forbes notes that demand for tickets has, quote, softened, resulting in lots of empty seats and dropping prices. And guys, the decline does not stop here. Google Trends report that after peaking around the time of the MTV VMAs, Searches for Miley Cyrus were down by 80% by the time Bangers tickets went on sale, which has resulted in ticket sales going from an average of $225 each all the way down to $182 each. Keep in mind that even with this drop in Google search and ticket sale prices, seriously guys, Miley Cyrus is still a huge success. But the softening in demand she's experiencing comes as a polar opposite to what we've seen with the guys of One Direction. The band's tickets were a hot commodity when they first went on sale, and demand has done nothing but increase, pushing the group to add nine new shows. Forbes had this to say about the reasoning behind the difference between Miley Cyrus and One Direction. Quote, One Direction has been doing their best to cross over from boy band to legitimate artists. While Miley seems focused more on how she can shock than her progression as an artist. It's an interesting point, but we just want to know what you guys think. We know that Miley is really creative when it comes to giving her fans surprising and sometimes even shocking performances, but do you think she should do what Forbes seems to suggest and really just focus back in on the music? Give us your thoughts in the comment section below and click right on over here if you want details on another artist making waves in the music scene. It's Lord. We are breaking down seven things you didn't know about the talented and oh so mysterious Grammy winner. I'm Jocelyn Davis in the studio. Thanks for watching.